Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Akabane101, and welcome back to Dark Cloud. It's early in the morning. Apparently early is 8.13 a.m., doesn't matter. I woke up at 7, all right? We're, I was like, you know what? I got time for four class. I can record a video. <laughs> and I was thinking, like, I'm like, oh, what episode is this one gonna be? Oh, I know. It's the building episode. So bear with me as, uh... I get my bearings and we figure things out. I'm also gonna just do a quick adjustment here. One sec. There we go. Now the uh, the background audio won't duck out as much, but I don't know. It's still kind of quiet. We'll figure it out as we go along here. Anyway, uh, if we go to analysis, we'll have a bunch of objectives that we need to complete in this episode. And well, I don't know if we're gonna be able to complete all of them because typically you do get most of your objectives uh, about halfway through, which is where we're at. We uh, hit the canonical uh, roadblock point, which is very common in Dark Cloud 1 and 2, where you just can't progress until you've done something here in the past, which affects the future. You go to the future, figure out what the heck changed, and usually you'll get an item or a trinket or something that will allow us to continue on and proceed to the uh, end of the dungeon. Um, in this case, it's like a key for a door or something along those lines that will actually let us proceed uh, in that case. So, we're gonna figure this out. We're gonna try and go uh, one thing at a time. Uh, we are gonna need to clean some stuff up if we can, but I don't think we can do anything about these steam vents because uh, I think we have to. I think you have to put like clay or something over top the steam vents uh, in order to keep them from being little buttholes. Because I, I think one of the objectives is to get rid of 100% of the steam vents. That being said, I'm pretty sure I have a shot of the steam vent already geyser yeah so we're good on that front and we've already seen a building burn down or rather seen the results of a building burn down it doesn't really matter as it's burning down <laughs> uh because we're horrible pyromaniacs what can i say um anyway let's go to analysis so second floor of workshop restored so all of these are going to be related to the future so all the objectives on the top are going to be the future and by the way i'm saying this stuff for myself because i'm trying to figure this stuff out while we go <laughs> It's been a while, okay? It's been a while. Uh, so these are gonna complete various tasks, so... Second floor, third floor, workshop elevator, gun dorado workshop, work crane, work arm, operation room, part shop. We don't know, we don't know. And Pasnos completed. Uh, it's probably gonna be a while until we get Pasnos completed, considering it's the last on the list. So let's maybe try and do the very first one. Second floor of workshop restored. We just need three sturdy houses. The culture points will come as we go. And culture points are just how good our shit looks. So, uh, we need sturdy houses and they can't be made out of wood. As we have known uh, in previous episode, it burned down. It looks like this hardened pile of mud. Oh yes, I think the mud is what we use to get rid of the uh, the steam geysers. Which I, I think after you complete this dungeon, uh, the volcano itself stop, stops giving off crap to burn down your houses, but then also once you do all this, you, I think you need to also get rid of all the steam geysers to be able to uh, succeed in that in that thing. I know we need a great crane. I'm pretty sure we need a generator, but we're doing we're doing one thing at a time. We're gonna make this place look good, but for now we're just going to try and uh, get these houses out and ready to go. Okay, what's the difference between a mailbox and a sturdy house? Or mailbox. I mean, I can tell you the difference between a mailbox and a sturdy house, but I meant the uh, the brick house and the wooden house. What the hell? Okay, I guess technically only the, the brick house is going to be the sturdy one. Also, we're probably going to need to st uh, talk to Conda again, but we'll see. We need three of these. Oh, you're killing me. You're killing me, game. All right, I will BRB. BRB. All right, actually, I lied. I'm not going to BRB. I'm going to make this guy. I'm going to make this iron house with an iron stand. And then I'm going to have a nice iron shed, because of course I am. And iron stairs. Excellent. All the iron in the world. An iron chim- Not an iron chimney. We don't need no iron chimney. I'm really curious how we're going to make this town look, because it's actually- It's almost an Arun Village-esque in terms of, like, the, the creation style that we have here. Like, we can only do so much with it, but we do have a lot of playing fields to work with. It's just one big arena for us to slap down the dankness. So, let's see how we do. Uh, we got two brick houses. I'm pretty sure brick houses do not burn down. I'm pretty sure. If they do, I am sad. Because <laughs> I, I do not want them to burn down. We're definitely going to need to grab more scrap metal, get some laundry maybe, I don't know. 
And, and oh yes, I want to do some stuff with fences. I want to make sure those are looking good. I Apparently we can just make a windmill. I want to, you know, get a church in here, get like a windmill. I don't know, we could do lots of stuff. And then obviously generator, great crane, and uh, power arm, gonna get those. And then these lovely hardened mud piles, they'll come into play soon enough. Soon enough. All right, what do we got here? Why do we, oh, we have a, sh we have a crap ton of stuff. All right, all right. Now, big question, can we have foundation? in the form of wood <laughs> for our brick houses. Is this, a, is this a possibility? Is this a thing we can do? I'm not seeing it like flash red, so we might be okay. We might be all right. Also, I kind of didn't think about this. Hold on. <laughs> Get rid of it. All right. Uh, I definitely like that though. I definitely like the idea of having a uh, a little wooden bottom to it, a little wooden foundation. Here we go. All right, move this around. There we go. There we go. Uh, we're gonna have to work with the steam vents as best as we possibly can here. Like, there's just no, there's no if ands, or buts at the moment. Um, but I promise you, there will be a 2.0 video of this where we're actually doing it real, doing it full real. Uh, you know what? We'll have one on the foundation. We'll have one off the foundation. Almost like we're uh, we're doing like an upgrade tree. <laughs> we have uh, and then we have an iron one. So whoever gets this one, I mean, I don't know how nice it would be to be in a metal, uh, a metal like circular building, in right next to a volcano. It must not feel great. I can't imagine it being too great. Uh, so we'll give it to Cedric. <laughs> he he'll just say, "Oh, thanks, Shuddy. By the way, can I interest you in?" Shum of my wares. Apparently, he's just trying to sell me crap. Um, nice. We're looking good. We're, we're looking good so far. I think the crane has to be on one of the buildings. Um, oh yeah, we have a brick chimney. Get this guy in here. Again, this is this is so slapdash. It's not even funny, dude. This is ridiculous. Uh, boom. But trust me, this is this is what I'm limited to at the moment, especially with brain capacity at uh, at max. Was cool. <laughs> Bring capacity at max. I can't, I can't change it. I can't, wait, iron chimney. Can we, okay, wait, hold on. Can I get an iron chimney in like the house? In like the iron house, I mean to say? Let's see. Nice, nice, move this over. Cause I know Cedric's supposed to move in here, but we're gonna, we're gonna have to move him in and then re-recruit him back into the, uh, into the, into the team. It's kind of weird offsetting the house a little bit, but I don't know. It's kind of different, I guess. I kind of like it. I've also, I also want to play with colors more. Um, that's one thing I've been kind of missing out on is uh, I haven't really been doing much with colors on the houses. And uh, I was watching a trailer for Dark Cloud 2, and it was mainly just showing off the Georama and how advanced it is and how much better it's gotten. Um, so I really, really, really would like it. Actually, this, this is such a terrible spot for the, for the laundry. I want it on like this. Can I not do the side? Are you saying that people don't do their laundry and then hang it off the side of their brick house? All right, I'm gonna put it right over here. There you go. Amazing. Uh, wait, how do I, how do I, um... Oh, okay, so you just have to press triangle there. Okay, great. But yeah, I don't know. It's, uh, it looks really nice when you have like nice colors that kinda make things look a little bit more organic. People had some more personal tastes. So what we'll do is we'll probably end up looking at the uh, the character that we're putting into the houses and then adjust uh, adjust for it. I think that would work really well. Okay, we have three sturdy houses. Our uh, culture points ain't quite there yet. We're at 24 of culture points. I wish it would break it down why or what house has how many points. It'd be a little bit easier, wouldn't it? If we could actually see that. But I guess at this point, not gonna really matter. House place three blocks high. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't expect that. <laughs> All right, I have an idea. You know the one that we didn't put on anything? That's the one. All right, three blocks high. So we have blocks. Um, these ain't big enough though. Um, <laughs> definitely not. So let's figure this out. We need. Yeah, this is the foundation I'm looking for. Okay, we're gonna go to Conda. 
I'll be right back. I have returned to the train. Hello, Granny Rosa. Uh, actually, hold on. Granny Rosa. I would like to add you to my party. You have something I require. Something I necessitate the need of. Um, let's make. Let's not make. Let's character. There we go. We charactered. Into Granny Rosa. We character into Granny Rosa. Don't think about it. Gimme, 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 gimme. Thank you. Delicious cheese. Absolutely glorious. All right. I don't got no grape juice for you, Mr. Condiman. But what I do got is everything. Oh, there is hay right here. Oh my gosh. Uh, I think the odd guys mentioned that. Uh, oh, I'm gonna sell some crap. Yeah, look at me go. Look at me go. We're gonna sell some crap, all right? Y'all are gonna be so happy. Sell all this crap. Actually, I <laughs> see this is the problem. I kind of want to hold on to these, these baits until I really figure out what I want to do. <laughs> I'm gonna hold on to the bait. Uh, I will definitely sell this stone, because the stone is crap. Um, definitely need antidote. I wish we could find something to replace antidote for our upgrades. Uh, and then this silver ball, we'll just hold on to the silver ball, because for all I know, we're going to need it for some sort of building. And a random... Oh, we have a bullseye coin. Nice. Sweet. I think we're good on everything else. We just have a crap ton of clothing. And obviously... Wow! Wow! Look at that! $505! Just for a little bit of EXP. A level 10 wrench is worth 500 bucks to sell in comparison to a battle wrench at, at 100 gold. I wonder if you build this up if it drops in price because it goes back to a level 0 weapon. That's interesting. That's a lot of money. Considering how long does it take for us to get like a level 10 wrench? Not that long, maybe like five minutes. I mean, it's probably not like efficient in terms of like earning cash, but I don't know. That's interesting. That's a uh, that's interesting. Oh shit! God damn it! Uh, that's interesting though. Looking at the uh, the cost to value ratio, because it costs two hundred for a wrench. Get the wrench to level ten. It's worth five hundred bucks. Pretty, pretty, pretty cool. Uh, all right, we're just gonna buy. I don't know, thirty. How much are we at for this one? Not a lot. Not a lot at all. We're gonna go 40. There we go. We're breaking all the rules. We're not we're not keeping things uh, at a steady amount. There we go. I'll, I'll do that one for you. <laughs> let's go to let's go to 20 on this one. This is the thing, whenever you're doing building, it always like eats up your uh, your resources. I mean this is resources we could be using. Oh, flower. You betrayed me, flower. Freaking holy. Why do why is flower for exorcism? Is it because you put flower on the floor and then you come back and there's footprints in it? I play too much phasmophobia. <laughs> phasmophobia is too good. Uh, I think we're good on these. Scrap metal. Let's just go all in. Scrap metal. You can never have enough scrap metal, can you? One hundred. You can just keep going. Actually, hold on. Am I is the stack above a hundred or am I now with two stacks? Okay, okay, I need to, like... Oh, can I not sort while I'm, like, in this menu? I guess not. Where'd the where'd the scrap metal go? I'm just curious. Can we have more than 100 stack? Oh, we can! Well, look at that. That's cool. I like that. Uh, hunk of copper, we're good on. All these elements, we should be good on, because we just... You just get elements like you wouldn't believe when you're, uh, when you're farming these dungeons. Or, not even farming, just running through them, really. Alright, I'm gonna get a little bit more of this. I'm gonna get ten more. Nice! I think we're good. I think we're good. Alright. My body is ready. It's probably something I should have done before I started the video, but let's not worry about that. Preparing for a video? Too hard to do? This is why I have a notepad that I- <laughs> that has incorrect information on it sometimes. Uh, mainly because of my own fault. Hello! Uh... Oh yeah, we can upgrade the right pod. Well, I'm not gonna worry about it. Repair my robot parts. Thank you. I always forget about that, and add him to my party. Oh, Cedric. You are amazing. In every way. Uh, alright, let's move. Move on out. And we're gonna go back to Mount... Not Mount Gondor. Mount Heimrada. <laughs> or I'm remembering some things. Gosh darn. We're playing Dark Cloud 1, so a lot of my brain power is just, like, all invested in that. And then also, um... Well college, but let's not worry about that. 
Uh, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We want to we wanna make sure that we do this right, but at the same time, I'm like, how do we do this? <gasps> no! It's been murdered. It's been murdered. I wonder if that was just because of the wood pile, though. Oh, God, we're sharing things. Don't, I don't want to share. <laughs> no way, though. That sucks. Is that really because of the wooden bottom? I think brick houses are fine, right? Are they not? I must now find out. We're going to play. Okay, we're just going to do this. Because I don't want to make another brick house. Oh, wait, we got our brick house back. Interesting. So the game is nice. It didn't murder the house because the house is okay. And I don't think it murdered the laundry either. But what it did murder was the, uh, the, the wooden, like, bottom. Okay. Well, that's okay. Whew. I feel a lot less bad now. That's good. That's real good. Okay, you know what? I'm trying to, like, think here. I know, it's crazy for me, but, uh, I'm trying to think here. I, I kind of want to get more sturdy rocks, uh, if I'm being honest. If I'm being honest. I want to... God, I need, I need a ton of sturdy rocks for what I want to do, but I kind of want to keep... I want to make this entire area kind of more, more raised. Uh, you know what, at the same time, maybe, uh, maybe I will... Well, not, in, not even just under place, but... I would very much like to go to hardened mud pile. Let's just do let's do ten of them. Let's do ten of them. I've already got the image of the of the steam geysers. Let's just get this crap out of here. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. That's not even all of them. Ten. But that's most of the central ones done. So that's that's good enough for me. I like this. Uh, I like the metal building. The metal bu building is kind of actually cool. Okay. So we got that down. Now we have we have blocks. And we have block twos. All right. Excellent. I just want to see something though. If we go one. It's interesting how we don't get to continue putting those down. Okay. One, two. This is just the small blocks. So this would be like. The blocks that get you there to your crazy platform of nonsense. And then, oh no, are we not allowed to like slap this onto the side? Are we breaking all the rules if we do something like this? Oh, I guess, actually, oh, this actually looks kind of cool. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, this is actually kind of crazy. This is not that bad. Uh, <laughs> I, okay, am I crazy? No, oh, I am crazy, damn it, you can't, you need to have a, fa a proper foundation. Could you imagine, though, having, like, a setup like that? Oh, that'd be so cool. That'd be so cool. But you have to have, like, a full foundation. That's, that's unfortunate. Um, gosh, oh, man, I have ideas. All the ideas in the world. But oh, I don't think it's possible. I want to. I want to like have it spiral up, but I don't think that's actually going to be a thing I can do with our with our current circumstance. We just gotta. We just gotta deal with it. All right. All right. It is what it is. I mean, it can. We can spiral it up. But it just has to be like this, on a stand. Like on a standard. <clears throat> like on, on a standard. We're gonna have a central pillar. Oh man. Oh man. If only I had infinite cash in this game. If only I had infinite money. Oh, we have one more of these things. And then we do one more, and it goes to three. And then we do one more, and it goes to four. Or this would actually be like our staircase. No, no, we have a staircase going up all around. It looks amazing. And it would be great. And I'm going to go to Conda. All right, Sturdy Rock. We're going we're gonna to bend the market. We're going to bend it like crazy. Like you wouldn't believe. One hundred... Sturdy rocks still might not be enough. Sorry, we gotta fund we gotta fund the sturdy rocks somehow. So I'm sorry, we're selling some fish. We're selling some fish. We're gonna clean up our inventory a bit. 
Uh, I'm gonna get rid of the carrots. There we go. There you go. I don't even- I don't want the shrimp either. Alright, we're good. We got potato cakes, that's all I care about. I'm keeping the- I'm keeping the poison apples. Um, and we'll- we'll figure out the fishing stuff later, but for now... This is the way. Also, we already have a big fish, so don't worry about it. See, we're fine. Uh, okay. Can we move from the train? I really do hope so. Yes. Yes! This is called efficiency. Speed run en route. Absolute, absolute speed run. We're only, what, like 45 hours in? No big deal. Don't worry about it. Uh, we're, we're way ahead of schedule. <laughs> we're, 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 we're knocking it out of the park. Oh, I'm really, I'm really excited. I've never done this setup before, so this is gonna be, this is gonna be real fun. All right. Let's get, let's get, because, oh, then we can have, like, different pill. We have pillars going into pillars. Oh, oh, it's gonna be so freaking Cool. All right, hold on. Hold or. Uh, yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. I really do wish though they would let me like have supports so I don't have to build it like this. <laughs> Wouldn't that be nice? Wouldn't that be the dream? Can a man not dream though? Uh, do we have any arches like brick arches or anything like that? No. Okay. Man, we could have a house on each of these, can't we? That would be cool. All right, hold on, though. We're not there yet. We're not quite ready yet. This could be like a crazy, like, generator crane, crane man. We could have, I think maybe we can get Cedric in this one. That would be real neat. Um, okay, so. We have this guy here, which would be like our foundation for the bridge. Um, I also, okay, hold on. Bridge block. So let's let's make like two bridge blocks because we're gonna need at least two, and then this is our this guy here. This block three is going to be like our our actual bridge bridge because I don't think we can do anything about the supports other than just dropping them down. And we're gonna need some stair blocks. Gonna need some stair blocks. I don't know. Hmm. I'm curious. I'm curious how we're gonna do this. Let's let's go for three stair blocks for now. We can always get more. But listen, sturdy rocks aren't that expensive, and we can always also just farm more for this stuff. So it's it's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, bridge block, bridge block. I knew it. I knew it was gonna be like this. I can't believe it. Uh, that's all right though, because we have we should still have. Oh, we don't have the small blocks. Okay, it's gonna get the small blocks. Just regular old, regular old block blocks. I get three of those. Nice. We're, we're already like low on block or on uh, not blocks, but uh, <laughs> uh, what is it called? Freaking sturdy rocks. Uh, all right, all right. Where's my bridge? My bridge block. Bridge block enabled. Excellent. Excellent. I love I love where we're going with this. I really, I really, I really just need supports. Like, can we just not have supports? Is supports not a thing? I don't think supports are a thing. God, I really wish they were though. Like, I I desire supports. Um, that's all right. That's all right. We just we just spend all of our money. I think that's that's the plan. We just spend all of our money. What the hell? Why is it so off? Did it not? Did I remove snapping? Did I remove snapping by accident? I must have removed snapping. Shut up, beach. Uh. Magnet off. There we go. Wait, I want it on. There we go. Oh, I still have to, like, finagle. Okay. So do that. And then... That seems to snap okay. I, man, that's weird. Okay, and then... And then we just do this. Like, what's the point of having the arch and the bridge if I can't... <laughs> if I can't make a proper bridge? <laughs> this makes no sense. This makes no sense. Anyway, this will go over here into another spot, and then we'll have like another setup over here, and it'll look amazing, and it'll be the best thing ever. And then I will, I will cry because it looked good. It looked good. All right, nice, nice. Um, I'll keep this on the right for now. Yeah, keep that on the right. Keep this on the right. Seems to work nice. And then this one over here. 
Nice. Should be good. Unless... Unless I have these going on the on the outside in. That could probably work. Maybe. I don't know. Well, for now, I guess we'll do this, because we only have three stairs. We can make more, but for now, this is okay. Look at that! All the brick in the world. You ain't never seen nothing like this. This is the great this is the greatest the greatest town that ever existed. Alright. Uh brick house, please. Oh, what the shit? When were brick houses this huge? Get out of here. Okay, we can... <laughs> I can... I can squeeze it in. I can squeeze it. Are you serious? We're so close. We were so close. Oh, we just have to expand it. We just have to expand it. That's okay. That's okay. Okay. This bridge idea will come into play later. But for now, we're going to focus on just having the foundation for what we're trying to do here. I think that's I think that's going to be the strat. That's going to be the pro strat. Actually, hold on here. Maybe. Maybe. We can do that and then have two houses branching out. Oh, genius. What can I say? I'm a genius. Um, yeah, there we go. So we'll put one staircase up here. And then we'll have a second staircase right here. So let's go make, where's my, where's my staircases? My staircase eye, I need them. Stair blocks, they're really not that bad. They're only five. So it's not like you're really hurting. Nice, there we go. And then maybe another one. Oh, that's not what I want. Gotta remember this, there's a difference between place and make. Uh, all right, make it. And let's let's place it, please. Did I just make another one? I probably did. God damn it. I was too quick. That's all right. It's all right. We can work with it. Nice. Oh, that looks good. That looks good. And then we'll have this one branch out to the right. And then this one branch out to the left. There you go. That's how you do. That is how you do. I really like that. Um, okay. Uh, let's... I guess we still have to make more of those freaking blocks. Which ain't great, I might add. Because they are expensive. These block twos? Oh. Oh. You're killing me, game. You're killing me. Can I... Okay, can I maybe use... Like, I don't know. Maybe it's cheaper to use regular blocks for this, but... Are these supposed to be, like, my supports? Oh! I just realized what these are used for. I just realized. Look, they're supposed to be arches. Uh, for you walking under them. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Okay. Interesting. And now we can build on top of that with our regular blocks. Interesting. I kind of like that a lot. I like it a lot. Uh, wow. Okay. That's not bad. That ain't bad. That ain't half bad. And then... Gosh. You can build pretty high in this as well, which is kind of nice. Okay, I can't put that there, because that's where the arch is going to be. Um, yeah. Sure, we'll do this. Because we got to expand it out just a little bit. I think we can just use two singular blocks here. Oh, man, it's going to be cool. I'm actually really excited. It's gonna be like a stone village. Watch me, watch me hit the max though, real quick, because of all these individual items. Like, as long as the game holds up, I mean, it should hold up because we're on a PS4, not the PS2. But we'll see. <laughs> we'll definitely see. Uh, okay. Moment of truth. Can we can we fit this big chonker on here? Not. I mean, this is not gonna be like the final design or anything. Why aren't you? Why can't you fit? It's prob. Oh, why I can see why. I can see why. Oh, here's it's so close. It just needs one more set. One more set. All right, give me a minute. I'm gonna go grab some more stone. Okay, I have claimed the stone. I'm going to have a stone empire. This is ridiculous. <laughs> I have so many stone. Uh, what can I say? 
I am the stone lad. Um, okay, so I just want to fix that little block there. I'm going to zoom in on it, too. It's weird, like, you'd think that the magnet would, like, just... Oh, okay, well, maybe it's just because I wasn't snapping it in like that. You have to, like, tap square, maybe. Well, no, it's still kind of off. I don't really know how to fix that, so... We're just going to have to live. Um, okay. We are going to... Let's clean this up, this bridge up for now, because we need to expand this top section just a little bit more. Um, I'll probably do the same sort of thing, maybe. Um, I don't know. Uh, unless you want to bridge out this way. Uh, I think, I think that'll work. I think that'll work. Let's do that. Let's do... I have to make this stuff. This is the worst part. It's just like, I want to keep making the same thing over and over, but I always lose it. Alright, um... I think we're going to need two, and then four. There we go. And then... Look at these... We have the flats, right? Uh, but we need the standard blocks. So we're going to get the standard... How much is the standard blocks compared to these? What? Why are the standard blocks worth that much? <laughs> That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. That's absolute insanity. Who did this? All right, you know what? Do we just build six of these? And just say, screw it to the dark gods? I don't know. Now I'm just like, man, really? Because look how much building blocks we're using. That's like 10, 20, that's 30 just on that one. I think we do it. I think we do it. And we use these for other stuff. Yeah. I think that's what we're going to do. Man. I really wish they would let me uh, have supports. This is like the one thing. The one thing I've always wanted. I need, I'm going to test something though. I'm going to test something. Hold on. Let's uh, let's do this. So if I, if I did something like this, I should be okay to place that uh, the big in, right? Do I not have the big in? Okay, I do have the big in. Yeah, I am allowed to do this. Okay, good. Good. Um, because, what? The bottoms are only five each, but then again, 5, 10, 15, 20, it's the same. <laughs> it's the same amount. <laughs> Damn it. That's alright, though. That's alright. Because we can actually, we can do that. We can work with that. I think, yeah, we can have a little archway. I think this will work. This will work. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah, so we get our bridge blocks. So we're putting our bri bridge blocks here. So we're gonna have one. We're gonna have two. Uh, gotta zoom in on this one. There we go, three, four. That's the one side. And then this guy. And then we'll, I think we'll just have to continue our bridges on because I need to also build out into this side. So it makes it kind of screws us up a little bit, but it is what it is. Gotta make two more bridges. Oh, baby. We're doing it. We're figuring it out. Building building in this game is so, so difficult because I want to do so much. And it takes so long. <laughs> it takes so long. How dare they do this to me? Look at that. Look at this. This is like a tunnel. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. Now this, this is crazy. And this is definitely like where they want it, right? They want three blocks high. Is there anyone that's like four blocks high? Okay, good. Um, right, there we go. So we're just gonna place that new block or well, we need to make another block too. There we go. We did it, we did it. Nice. Beauty. Look at us go. Look at us go. Ah, uh, talk about perfection. Just great. Just great. Alright. Just right. And then... Okay, I'm still pretty sure we're kind of... Not going to be able to put this, this house in. But if I can at least get this house in. I feel great. Oh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. So it's weird, because it's not like a bridge to go over. It's a bridge to go under. 
very strange, the, the design of that. But it works, I guess. <laughs> uh, it gets it gets the job done. So if we go to our analysis there, three sturdy houses placed. Wait, what do you mean three sturdy? Oh, oh, oh that's right, because we were gonna put we we're gonna put the other house in there. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't think about it. Um. Okay. Resident in house with chimney. Third floor of workshop restored. Sixty culture points. And then what else? Borneo resides in Heimreda. Okay. This is not bad. This is not bad at all. In fact, we're pretty much there. I think for now, we're gonna we're gonna cheap out. We're gonna cheap out. We're just gonna drop this guy. But we have a plan now. We have we've established a design, a design philosophy. I love the idea of a tunnel, in because it's kind of like almost shielding you from the the harsh area, the harsh climate. And you can walk up here, go say hi to Crazy Workshop Man. And then we have another, oh god, and break your ankles because there's no railings. Then we go up here, and then we can head off to the right side, and potentially, you know, get more stuff going on. Get another, get another building. And look at that, we're looking off into the dungeon. Oh man, that's gonna be cool. That's gonna be real cool. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna stop it there. We're gonna stop the video here. Um, I'm gonna come up, come up with a bit more game plan. Um, also, I gotta head into school, so it doesn't really help. Um, and then in part two of our building, we're gonna we're gonna see what we can do with railings, with some fences. Uh, maybe expand on this. We might have to farm some money. Uh, so if anyone has some money farming stretch, do let me know in the comments below. That really is super helpful because it allows me to do some more building, and more building is great because I need I need I need this outlet. This is very fun. I'm definitely a big, big fan. Huge fan of this tunnel. So, this is gonna be... This is gonna be like our central point, I think. Yeah. Yeah! This is gonna be awesome! Okay, thank you so much for watching, guys. And I'll see you all in the next one. Uh, no outro this one, so, uh, bye!